Warning! The first really warm day of the season is the perfect time to guzzle down a blizzard. We had a multiplication party and I ate it too fast and I got a brain freeze. Oh. So there's an actual word for this. It's called sphenopalatine ganglioneuralgia. Sphenogalic, holy moly. <laughs> say that fast three times. Uh. I can't even say it once. <laughs> I am a neurointerventionalist. Dr. Yasha Kayan treats vascular diseases of the brain and spine at Abbott Northwestern. I feel a little silly asking you this then. What happens when you eat your ice cream really, really fast? Um, I get a brain freeze. Well, no one knows for sure, but we think it has to do with the body's reaction to the cold. It's like a protective mechanism. And your brain's like, stop eating ice cream? Yes. <laughs> but I don't listen to it. One of the theories is that there's extra blood flow to the brain and that increases the pressure in the brain and that gives you a headache. Is it worth it? Yes. <laughs> so is it actually a pain in our brain? Possibly, it's probably not the brain itself. It's probably either the lining of the brain or it could be referred pain from your face. You know, it's, it's having like an ice cream cone party in your head. What does referred pain mean? Well, it's like when you get pain in another location and because your nerves are complicated, they can transfer the pain over and make it feel like you're hurting elsewhere. It's kind of like when people have shoulder pain when they're having a heart attack. That's what you were going to say? Yes. <laughs> I mean, this is melting. You guys better eat this up real quick. Yes, we should. Oh, I don't want to get a brain freeze. <laughs>